Okay, in this video I'm going to demonstrate my modified CDV 715 survey meter. I got some plans online from techlib.com. Really great website, a lot of different circuits that you can build and especially a lot of stuff to do with ionization, radiation, stuff like that. The guy's really nice, his name is Charles Wenzel. I had a couple of issues and I emailed him and he was very, very kind to help me out and get this thing sorted out. If you buy these meters as is on eBay, they're pretty worthless to the average person because they don't detect alpha, they don't detect beta, and they're designed to detect only extreme levels of gamma radiation. So what I did is I pretty much gutted the whole unit and built a new circuit inside, one that charges the housing to about 50 volts, and then there's an ionization circuit for detecting the alpha, beta, and gamma radiation. And I have it on a pretty sensitive level right now. I have it on the point 0.1. And right here is a piece of americium. I'm just going to take it over here like this. I'm about an inch away. I'm a little hot. Right now about an inch and a quarter. That's on the one. And I'm going to put it on the 10 scale. Let me just zero it a little bit. There's a provision for zeroing it. So you got to be very careful. You want to go just to the left. Over that. And now you got to get a little closer because now you're on the 10 scale. I'm about half inch away. And I go to the 100 scale. And I could adjust that. Pretty easy to zero it on the 1 and the 100 and the 10. Not so easy on the 1 and the point 0.1. So now i got to get right on top of it. Right there. I'm right on top of it. Right on top of it right there. It's about three. Now according to him, you're converting this to from Rentkins to Miller Rentkins. And so this right here would be MR, not R H R. 